Book 5, Chapter 8 covers much on morality, a human concept, although some basis in wisdom is a double-edged sword. Part 1 deals with children. All of chapter refers to what a man shouldn't do. I just want to remind that man or woman should be read as adult toward child, no matter the sex. MAN 86 A man will not have intercourse with a woman child. MAN 824 A man will not make woman and children weep in fear. MAN 826 A man will not pass judgment hastily or in the grip of wrath. MAN 830 a man will not reject his kinfolk or leave his children unprotected. MAN 835 A man will not expose his nakedness to maidens or children. MAN 836 A man will not torment the helpless or corrupt the young. MAN 839 a man will not pander to the lusts and weaknesses of others, or seek to profit by them. This is mostly common sense, but I felt it needed to be highlighted in today's society. A few, like causing a child to weep in fear, are double-edged. After all, discipline is needed, and children will cry when disciplined. I see verse 24 and 26 as together. When in anger or frustration you act without thinking, it's always bad. Yet, far worse to do it toward a child. Those are at your mercy. Verse 30 does remind the adult you have a responsibility to give proper protection, even when absent. Verse 6 and 35 and 36 also are hand in hand. Children have eyes as well as ears. Your task is not just with saying the right things, but in showing by behavior that you follow your own teachings. I added verse 39, since to me vice and wickedness includes using children for the desire of others. It's at least as disgusting as partaking of it yourself.